how's it going everyone? One Doctor Genius here and welcome to another episode of my walkthrough series. Right, so we're currently continuing on our mission on getting the boots of Hot Walk. So in our last video, what we did is we basically did another quest with Slurpee, and then we ended up on the mission to find his turnips, because it turns out he had accidentally put raisins in the queen's stew, queen got angry, we had to ask the guards what the queen liked, and now we're on our way to get him turnips. Now turnips are one of the rarest things in Bonfire Spire, so what we have to do is we have to go through a certain way in order to get them, although it won't be too hard. Well, if you exclude the arena, then yes, I can't remember the time. I mean, boss battle, yeah, I lost one. That was mainly because I was doing a challenge, but other than that, I still haven't. Now that we have gone down over here, you guys can see we'll have to battle this monster, then we'll have to go across. And once you head across, you guys will see that we talk to the royal collectors. They say there's a monster bugging them. We battle the monster. We collect the turnips. We head back to Slurpee, and then we get our next quest, which is that to deliver the queen's food. So we're getting very, very, very much closer to what our goal is. Alright, so over here you guys can see all three of our pets leveled up and now our funky is evolving into the next evol- Alright guys, so over here what you guys saw, all three of our pets gained enough stars. Alright guys, so as observed over here, it seems like all three of our human pet monsters decided to level up. So our Fathom, so our Fen Bun Funky actually evolved into Benil, and our Wizard leveled up got a Quandra Cube and our Aqua Star gained 89 stars. So if you ask me, that was pretty cool. Let's collect our member stars and then open our chest. Alright guys, so it seems like we've reached level 20 and are able to unlock the arena, but we're not going to battle over there. We're first going to cross the cross from over here. So guys, make sure to skip this bird's monster battle and continue moving on forward to the side over here. And as you guys can see over here, it seems like that both of the workers over here are actually surrounded. As you can see over here, what I said previously did hold true. You guys can see that the worker slimes are actually surrounded by ashlets and they cannot move. Right, let's see how the situation develops. So it seems like that we are meant to click on them and we get put into a monster battle. Once we enter the monster battle, what you guys will see, it's our task to eliminate this foul monster which is threatening these worker slimes. And after these foul monsters have been removed, we shall be able to get rewarded with a turn up. So then Slurpee cooks a stew, we just book it down to the kitchen. Uh, what do you call it? The Chef Shabellini steals the stew. Then what we gotta do is we gotta book it back to Slurpee, battle some monsters, book it back to the slime workers, back to Chef Shabellini, and we should be good to go. Ah uh, yes, we have finally defeated one Astrid, so we should be able to get one slime print from the slime guy. And once we get the slime from the slime worker, we can go to the next guy and basically take the turnip, which is quite nice. Easy turnips, we didn't even have to battle any monsters. Oh man, I really wish this went faster. Faster. Alright, so now what we do is we can click on the slime worker and as you can see, he thinks... So basically, he thanks me for my help and gives me a turn up, as needed. And now over here you guys can see there's a locked chest and this locked chest proves that we're moving on further along. Because this chest is locked, what you guys will notice is that, well, first of all, I disappeared. And second of all, this is the chest which we will need the magical key to get and then we'll be able to get to the boots of hot walk which will allow us to walk across water. So now let's quickly pull a spooky on these guys and click on the worker slime from behind. Wait, no, I'll walk across lava, I mean not water. Alright, now let's pull a spooky on this slime and go to him. No, no, what are you doing? You should have gone from behind- Oh my god. You know, I was really just hoping that the wizard would walk behind the mountain instead of going around the entire path, but okay. Do what you want, I guess. Alright guys, so we've defeated another monster and now we'll be able to obtain ourselves a turnip. You know, I've never been so excited to get a turnip before. Fun fact, I think- wait, aren't turnips the same thing as beetroots? Wait, let me search it up. Right, so according to my conclusions, beetroots are different from turnips. Beetroots are shiny, red, and- well, they're decent tasting, while turnips are- Alright, so let's just take the- Alright, so let's just take this 
very overweight looking turnip from this poor slime worker who's had to carry it and now let's head back so now that we've head back slurpy will say valiant efforts he'll give us some items and food dish and then blah 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 we have to take it now to the queen let's quickly do this before any monsters respawn in as you can see the monsters are already starting their ritual of spawning in so we need to get across as fast as possible let's head up over here no <laughs> hey guys so my only goal right now is to actually make it to the queen and then give the dish that's all i want all right so we finally finished up this enemy team and hopefully we will be able to get across from here to the next stage and hopefully deliver the queen's dish without having to battle any more monsters hopefully all right guys so that's gonna be into this video i hope you guys enjoyed it um i'll be delivering the queen's turnip stew tomorrow Alright guys, so hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, and give this video a humongous thumbs up if you guys haven't already. I will be catching you all next time when Dr. Genius out the house. Bye and have a good time. Bye!